twin flames and welcome to the dm to the f reading for monday so i'm going to bring in two powerful decks of cards today that are going to work very well together the beyond indigo divine union deck and georgie's deck blue iris tarot the dm messages to the df so what do the masculines want to say now before i even start this reading i feel that there's so much healing occurring today around the throat chakra and you're going to be feeling this so if you're having ascension symptoms today more than likely it's connected with the throat chakra in some way and remember ears nose and throat it's all connected so anything in this area crown to the throat and even the heart is all connected with ascension so i feel it's more about the upper half of ascension than the lower half if you are having any stomach issues or you are having any issues in the lower half of your body that's to do with movement but everything else is to do with opening up to communicate and speak the truth and even now look at this we've got the light shining through and i've got two white lights floating around which are like orbs and they are bringing a healing into this area here so the masculine is feeling this magnetic pull to you divine feminine to express themselves and show you how they feel they may not be able to do it right now but this is what they're working on so it's like he's saying to you, I know you're the one, I know everything really inside, just give me a little bit of time to be able to feel it and process it, to understand it, to express it. So regardless of what the cards are, I feel that's intuitively what the message is. So what do the masculines want to say to you today? What do the masculines want to say to you today? What do the masculines want to say? What do they want to say to you today? What do they want to say? Okay. So he's saying to you, there's trust issues. So he knows that he's hurt you and caused you pain and affected the way you trust. And he wants to make it right. So he's saying to you, it's not that I have trust issues because of you. So he's saying to you, I do trust you. I know that you are the one for me. But I need to prove to you that you can trust me. So he may be healing trust issues connected with the past and healing the past, healing wounds around trust. But it's like he's saying to you, you know, I am your greatest teacher and I'm teaching you to trust in me, to trust in this love. And as a divine feminine, trust is a big one we learn because we have to learn to trust the journey and learn to trust the process of it and learn to trust the universe to have our back. And when we let go of trying to control everything, that's exactly what we do. There may be a third party affecting things and that could also be bringing up trust issues. So if there is a karmic situation or there is someone else involved in this, this is also helping you to trust in the love. And you may say, well, how does that help to trust in the love? It's because you realise on this journey through that catalyst to your union, that karmic energy, that no other compares to you, that you are the one that this journey is unstoppable. And in today's Daily Twin Flame reading, that's exactly what your masculine said. I am unstoppable in my determination to get to you. Our love is unstoppable. It's unbreakable. Nothing can hurt it or affect it, even a karmic partner. So the karmic partner may be affecting things because you may have trust issues because of that person. Thinking, if he loved me, he'd leave her or him and be with me but it isn't always as easy as that because there's maybe things like obligations children a sense of duty things that need to be healed so again we're being asked to trust that the love conquers fear and i'm dreaming you into reality and i love this because i spoke about this the other day how i watched an episode of the sandman and it was about the barriers breaking down between the dream world and the real world and that's what I'm feeling. You know, what you're dreaming about is coming into reality. And dreams are very powerful right now. You know, it came through earlier in the Twin Flame reading as well. The masculine is dreaming of you. And he's visualizing you and thinking of you. And bringing you into reality. So he's saying to you, I'm dreaming this love into the real world. And he is learning to love himself first. And believe it or not, that's also what the karmic partner does for the masculine because the karmic partner realises through that third party situation that that doesn't serve them. So he has to put himself first and stand up for himself and speak his truth to get out of that situation. So without that karmic partner, he wouldn't actually make that move. 
and you have helped me more than you know. So he's saying to you, Divine Feminine, you've really helped me on my journey. I may not tell you, I may not express it to you, but you have. And I want you to know that today. And look, yeah, I mean, I say it in there, it is. I want you to know how much I care. So he's saying to you, I want you to know how much I care. I know I'm dealing with some stuff right now, but I am dealing with that stuff. And I will be with you. And I know that you're the one. And this is exactly what I'm feeling. He's thinking. And he's saying, I'm trying to understand our connection. He's trying to understand. He's trying to navigate around the obstacles and understand the challenges and feel all of his feelings. And the throat chakra is being affected too. So this is the masculine admitting to you, you know, it isn't all magical and roses as people think sometimes on this journey because there may be a third party. There may be a karmic partner involved in this. There may be someone sticking the nose in and saying things that may keep him away from you. But in spiritual truth, nothing can keep you apart. This is unstoppable love. And that third party is actually a big catalyst to your union because it allows the masculine to love himself first. And when he loves himself, he will begin to put himself first. And that means choosing you. So you might think, oh, he loves himself anyway. He only thinks about himself. He's very selfish. But that's, give me fear. That's a very fear-based ego way of looking at it. It's a very limited way of looking at it because the masculines learn that they can trust themselves. A lot of fear coming up here. They can trust themselves to be open with you and honest with you and that you're not going to leave them or abandon them through self-love. So they are teaching you, Divine Feminine, to trust the love, to love yourself first. You know, this is what we learn as well as Divine Feminine, to trust the love and to give everything back to ourself we crave from them. But he's saying, I do want you to know how much I care because I do. I do know deep inside of me that you are the one and I am dreaming you into reality. So understand that you have helped me on my journey. You're still helping me. I'm just still trying to understand our connection. So a not now just means it's all aligning, ready for that yes now. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.